What's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Malt. So happy to be with you guys, and I know that y'all are excited because you just watched a video of me maxing. Oh, not maxing, but going to Town Hall 9. That's right, we're going to Town Hall 9, guys. Now, there's a checklist that we have to go over when it comes to going to Town Hall 9. So obviously we want to do our best to fill our gold and our elixir up before we get there. So I'm going to keep using loons, especially with the, uh, with the event that's going on. You can check in here. Um, and go to news and you can see special for a limited time all hogs and balloons train in half the time for half the cost So we're gonna keep using our loons guys a because I love loons. I love loonian and honestly the um, The air sweepers aren't affecting my loonian attacks that much So not a problem with that the biggest thing that we want is this the queen. That's right. We want the queen guys um, so we have got to save up, what is it, is it 40,000? I do believe it is 40,000, yep. So we've got to save up 40,000 Dark Elixir. We are at 11,491. So we're going to be farming a lot of Dark Elixir. So I've got some raids to show you guys um, of me doing just that. And my goal, obviously, as y'all know, is always like I'll attack a base that has like 800 or more Dark Elixir because it adds up pretty quick, especially with how quickly these loons are training up now. Um, and if I boost it, if I boost my barracks, then we're just going to go off because when we boost our barracks, it's so much quicker. Now, the only problem is the spells, of course. We can always boost the spells, but spells take so long. I wish that there was, I, I don't know, I just wish there was a, a easier way to finish them. Like, I wish you could finish your spells with gold or finish your spells with elixir. Am I right? If you guys think that's a good idea, freaking throw a like on the video because I think that would be awesome if you could finish your spells with gold or elixir. So you can train them up with elixir, train them, you can create them, you can brew them, whatever it is, but it would also be cool if you could be like, yeah, I'm just going to finish it for an extra 15,000 elixir or 15,000 gold, whatever it may be. So our goal, guys, the biggest goal before getting there is to have that dark elixir because I want to get my queen. I want to get my queen so bad, but we also want all that gold so that we can get our expos. Uh, let's see how much our ex how much expos are going to be. So expos are going to be... Wow, three million, so we got to get all six. <laughs> we definitely need to fill up our gold. Gosh, we got to fill up our gold in the next 10 days or in the next, what is it, nine days, 15 hours. Boom, that is what we're going for. That is what we're trying to do. So I'm going to go ahead and go in here, show you guys a couple replays. We're going to go over them, and uh, yeah, I guess that's going to be it. All right, guys, so here's the most recent attack that I just had. Found a base with 1,035 Dark Elixir. We own, we had all of our spells, but I don't know. There's an Air Sweeper down there doing some stuff. I was playing Call of Duty while I was recording this. If you guys didn't know, I play Call of Duty on my second channel, Molt Plays. Go check it out. But we're going to come in here hot. Uh, we've got a Rage spell right there. And that Air Sweeper is just being ridiculous, just pestering those loons over there on the side. But um, we'll go ahead and rage up the rest of these loons right here. We're also going to throw a heal spell on them, guys. If there's a wizard tower around your loons, freaking drop a heal spell because otherwise the wizard tower is going to wreck them. So they're just going to fly right back on through that heal spell. Um, those minions are going to get up in there and do work, but they did decide to go the opposite way, which was a little bit annoying. Um, we can actually see that they're working their way back around. Let's see where they're going to go. Nice. So they are going to head over to... Oh, it went down anyways. <laughs> the minion just took down that wizard tower, which is pretty freaking epic. So the only thing is, is 149 Dark Elixir mixed in with the clan castle and right down here with the uh, Dark Elixir drill. So we're taking as much of it as we can, but there's still one air defense down. Uh, there's still an air defense right there doing work. That wizard tower is also doing some work, but it's okay. Our king's gonna get up in there. Our minions are gonna be able to take out as much of that as can as they can from that clan castle. But there is still 41 right down here. So we are gonna get 994 dark elixir from this attack. Our king's gonna keep on working his way through. That's pretty much it. Like I said, I was playing Call of Duty while I did this raid. I dropped them all, dropped my spells, and I was like, well, I guess they're just gonna do their own thing. King's ability was already used, so we can go ahead and head out, guys. 994 dark elixir. That is freaking awesome. Let's go ahead and go to the next attack, all right? All right, guys, so here's the next attack. Here's the next attack, 1,092 Dark Elixir. Now, it is spread out amongst uh, the drills as well as the stores right here, and that's where our loons are heading. So we're going to go ahead and drop a Rage Spell right there as the loons get up in there. Come on, loons, get up in there. There they go. They're going to take that out. But the sad thing about this attack was Mr. Dragon. I hate dragons and clan castles, guys. They absolutely annihilate loons or anything so I dropped that heal spell uh, they're actually staying alive to a certain extent the dragon's about to start chasing them so we're gonna have to drop off another rage spell right up here in the corner so that, that dragon has the dragon has to stop following them so the dragon's uh, gonna slow down look at him he's being dumb he's just shooting the air right now our loons are working their way around they're just gonna keep on trolling that dragon making that dragon chase them and then we're gonna send all of our minions in right here there they go boom 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 so some of them are actually being really dumb and going after the king 
and then I really want them to split off and head for the Dark Elixir, but none of them do. So we only got 753 of that Dark Elixir so far, and uh, we're just going to drop our king off right here because I knew that I wasn't going to be able to get in there. Uh, the king, this guy right here, Mr. Dead Guy, Mr. Dead King was the one that ruined that attack for us because our minions were not able to get over there, but we did get 818 Dark Elixir from that attack. So those two attacks together, guys, adds up to about 17... Um, Hundred, actually closer to uh, eighteen hundred dark elixir, which is awesome. So, like I said, we are at eleven four ninety four. Now, the only thing is, my minions, I do train up uh, twenty of them each time that I attack, and as you can see, they are worth nine dark elixir. So that is going to be a uh, hundred and eighty dark elixir every time that I raid. So I have to make sure that I keep that in account as I go and attack. So. Uh, I guess the main checklist, like I was saying, for Town Hall 9 is going to be filling my gold storages so that I can get those um, expos first and foremost. That is going to be so freaking key for us. And then next, once we come up in here, I guess uh, since I loon a lot, I'm going to want to uh, max out my loons or get them up to level 6. And uh, that's going to be the next big priority for me, definitely, when it comes to what I'm going to spend my elixir on. Uh, so yeah, if you guys are excited about this, let me know down below. Go ahead and hit a like on that video. On that video, what video? This video? Yes, this video. <laughs> but that's pretty much it, guys. I'm super, super stoked about it. Um, I'm gonna need y'all's encouragement, y'all's support as I grind out this gold and this dark elixir over the next 9 days and 14 hours. It is going to be clutch, but I can't wait to start building some base designs, all that kind of stuff. We are going to have to make all of our walls and upgrade them. I'm going to keep this for probably, this base design for probably a couple days as Town Hall 9, maybe even a week as I grind out my walls and as I grind out my low level defenses and start uh, upgrading those and uh, all that kind of jazz. So that's going to be a lot of work, but you guys just got to be patient with me. You've been patient so far, so long, and it's finally here. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. I always, why do I always say that's pretty much it? I don't know. But I love you guys so much. Thank you for the support. You guys rock. You know that. My old tagline, guys, for the... Here, here. Let me know down below if you remember this as my old tagline. I used to say, you guys are so much cooler than me. That used to be my tagline. Who remembers that? Comment down below if you remember that because that was like back in the days when I had like 10K subs maybe. I would say, you guys are so much cooler than me. That was my, that was my closer. And then I switched to Keep Calm and Clash On. But you know what? Today we're going to say both of them, guys, because y'all legitimately are so much cooler than me. And I want to make sure that you guys keep calm and you clash on for me, right? I'll see you guys in the next episode, all right? Peace.